Here's a neat little package. Some plywood. Well, no, this is actually a little box. There's a cavity inside. It's all tied up, so should we open it? Well, they usually say it's better to do something than not to do anything. It's usually better to be active. In this case, I'm not so sure. This is what they call the Kadankan experiment. The term was first used by Hans Ersted in about 1812. It was a curious mixture of German and Latin. A thought experiment you kept up there and you didn't do an action. And then about 100 years later, Ernest Mach also adopted the term, the Mach number man. Most famously, Einstein also had Kadankan thought experiments. So this is one of these wonderful ones called the Schrodinger's Cats. It was developed by Owen Schrodinger in about 1935, and what he proposed was putting a cat into a box, alive, with a little fire of cyanide, and then a small hammer that would break it and kill the cat, but the, the cyanide itself was being operated by a Geiger counter, and the Geiger counter itself was going to be made active by a tiny little piece of radioactive material which would give off a particle. But when it would do so, or if it would do so, we don't know. So you never knew whether the cat was alive or whether it was dead until you opened the box. So here's an interesting case here where in order to keep Moggy alive for longer, or to imagine it's still alive, it's best not to open the box. That's something hard for me to do, because I'm desperate to do things. But here, I think for once, I'll restrain myself and hopefully keep the cat alive, at least in my head. What would you do? What's your Gedanken?